ladies and gentlemen, on this site will rise. This is the new landmark of the Philippines. Soon to rise is Nyon Landing. An iconic integrated leisure and entertainment resort in the entertainment city of Manila will be open to visitors in early 2022. Its name, Nayong Landing, evokes the rich cultural heritage of the Philippines landing in Manila. This family-oriented resort will offer visitors different forms of leisure and entertainment activities. The attraction zone will consist of numerous unique attractions to satisfy the desires of visitors from different backgrounds and age groups. In the indoor cultural theme park, there will be an amphitheater to host a series of cultural shows, a walkthrough display, and a tour of the country via a 360-degree theatrical presentation. A variety of other galleries will showcase the country's colorful festivals. Anchored on the Philippines' 2022 tourism vision, Nayang Landing is determined to become a world-class, must-see, must-experience destination for culture, leisure, entertainment, and business travelers. So what we're building is actually will be one of the largest uh, family leisure integrated resort uh, in the world. Um, it will cost 1.5 billion US when we open in 2022. Um, this will house the largest, if not the second largest, indoor theme park in the world. Um, you know, you have three massive uh, theme parks and water park and cultural park all combined within uh, the, our resort itself. And this is by itself will position um, definitely position Melilla in the space of the family destination and compete against, for example, the like of uh, even Universal Studios Singapore. We will be building Manila's biggest column-free, pillar-free uh, ballroom uh, for in the Philippines. This whole environment is all indoor, also with taking into account the weather condition, weather element. Um, so but it will be themed after the different regions in the Philippines. So right from the north, Luzon, Sayas, and also to the Mindanao. We expect to hire at least 10,000 jobs by the time we open in 2022. Uh, this would also, but like I mentioned in the beginning, this is about tourism. This is about driving and helping uh, Philippines achieve its 2022 tourism uh, target vision. Uh, I think our resort alone uh, will drive two to three new incremental new uh, visitation uh, to the to the city here and to the country.